What is going on guys? My name is Ron back in from my reviews here with another episode of reaction to the quintessential quintuplets season 2 episode 5 good work today. Now, as you guys know, last episode was a made me feel all warm inside because as you guys know, I am a huge fan and probably one of the pre one of the people who just realized that Nina was best girl. I started getting hints of it when I was reading the manga a while ago. But I started getting hints of it during around this time. Before the whole, oh, my heart, why is it going toki doki doki so much? I'm never going to do that again, I apologize. But, and I just realized, I was like, you know what? She's a Sunday. We all knew this. But she has her motives, she has her reasonings. What if she actually is best girl? And keep in mind, I was totally on board with, uh, with Amika. I had nothing but, uh, I, I, I had nothing but devotion, I guess you could say, for Miku. And I thought Miku was best girl. But, again, I was shown the way. This is the way. Of the waifu bible. And so, I now hold it to my chest and I had, don't know if I'm going to be using it today but I'm keeping it on the side to bless you my children with the Nino gang but going back on topic to this actual episode judging from the thumbnail it's going to be Ichika focused which I will admit Ichika is the most interesting character out of all five girls not gonna and her she ha probably has one of the best character developments I would probably say from everything that happens with her, it is the best amount of character development out of the five girls. Now, whether or not I prefer that kind of character development for that particular character, I'll let you guys know when we get to it. I don't know if we're going to start dabbling our toes into what's going on. But Ichika is a very interesting character. Definitely my... Probably still my fourth favorite Overall, I liked her actually, it, she was my second favorite for a while, um, but with everything that happens with Yotsuba, Itsuki, Ichika, Nino, Miku, after it was all said and done, she she dropped it a little bit, but not just due to the fact that her, the character developments from the other girls happened, just, Nino just skyrocketed from worst girl to best girl, um, and we're not going to see what really made me a true believer and true loyal gang member. Um, probably not until, not for a little while. We're probably going to get that a little bit further down the road. Uh, also, quick note, I'm not going to be doing a episode on Promise Neverland due to the fact that my recording had messed up and I don't want to re-record it. Uh, I don't know if you want me to do another separate video. I I'll see. But we'll go from that. But with this, see, with this, I don't remember how this goes. So we finish up with the seven, uh, the seven goodbyes. We got to see Nino starting to get those uh, heart palpitations for our uh, our main character, Futaro. I am curious on how this is going to end because we need to see Ichika's character development big time. Ichika is very essential and probably one of the most interesting i actually can't wait to see a few other reactors uh, uh reaction to this um i don't know if we're gonna it, but i'm not gonna say anything because i want you guys to be on board with it and not get spoiled because it's a it it, it definitely requires that if you haven't if you don't know what's happening it's best to go on blind because of, because of how different of a character development it is with Ichika. I'm not going to say any more, but I'm ready to jump into this episode, so without further ado, let's jump in to episode 5 of the Quintessential Quintuplet Season 2, starting in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. Oh, is that the pops? Oh, okay.
The father is an interesting character. I was good. Yeah, I was about to say. Ballsy man. The father is an interesting character. You know, I'm actually kind of glad. Oh, by the way, if you like Quintessential Quintuplets, the author just, um, at least from the translation, his new work is out, uh, Rangers Reject. Gotta say, the very after the first chapter, I'm th looking forward to it. Nothing much to say right now. I kind of said what I wanted to say about the series, uh, about this episode, and what I wanted to say already in the beginning. So I'll talk about I'll talk about the um, uh, the manga. So basically, I know it has nothing to do with this show, but it's the same author. So cut me some slack. But with this whole situation going on, um, with uh, it's basically the Ranger reject. It's Power Rangers from a different perspective from the villains of uh, uh, the villains perspective but they're not really the, the the power rangers or the rangers in this case aren't really the good guys in a way so if you're looking for something interesting in that kind of aspect i would recommend it it's 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 a pretty good uh series uh, first chapter i'm not gonna jump into any conclusion but it's one of those like after the first chapter i'm like i want to see more uh, it looks interesting enough there's a good twist at the end so yeah rangers reject Right <laughs> <laughs> The worst luck. Oh, Rana seen the kimonos. Mm. I remember seeing that panel in the manga. Oh, don't be mad. Don't be mad, Nino. Speaking of which, Nino and Futaro are like the number four ranked um, couple right now. Oh, look at that. <laughs> no, but, um, like they were doing like the top couple comparings. Um, number one was from Horamiya. Uh, number two was uh, Amelia and Subaru. Rest in peace. Just rest in peace, man. Uh, number three was Futaro Miku. And then number four was Futaro and Nino. We didn't get to see them in kimonos too much, which is a damn shame. <sighs> I accept. Oh, you lucky dog, you. <laughs> and he was saying he got the worst, like, you literally got five girls just touching you. I 
I don't remember what happens in this. And of course, I just realized it's, he gives the one given food because, of course, it is. Mmm. Okay. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at the. <laughs> Look at Ichika! Ichika! Ichika is totally... They act. Okay, so... Nah... <laughs> I know oh no I, I can already tell Oliver and uh, Mad Lad are just creaming themselves right now I'm sorry I'm so, I'm, I'm, I feel bad for you guys <laughs> I'll be your snack <laughs> Let me have this, okay? It's my first time. <laughs> Poor Ichika. The actress got acted, got out acted. <laughs> <laughs> Rest in peace, Mutan. Rest in peace, Yotsuba. You can get me. <laughs> I mean... Five thousand fifty bucks per person? Damn. Two hundred fifty bucks a day. How much do I, that's more than I make. Right? Hold on. Yeah. I had to do math, okay. That's actually quite more than I make. By the way, to the people who keep, who keep on saying that Raiha is best girl, you're a horrible person and you need to go to hell and save a seat right next to me. Right next for me. Oh my god, his mouth is right there and I can just kiss it. Oh, hey, Nino. Are you getting a little bit jealous there? I love how the focus is on the lips. You know, I actually kind of wish, like, at one point they actually show... And not particularly that scene, if you know what I mean. Um, them all having the same hair color, because that, that's what they are. They all have the same hair color. <laughs> Girls in business suits always just work. I don't care. Well-fitted business suits, by the way. Yep. 
You're too shy. I would be going to that place every day. That's right, yep. I'm telling you, bashful Nino is a gift from God. <laughs> All jobs take some type of commitment And if you don't, you're not You're just trying to make a quick buck You're never going to last there I forgot she sleep I believe she sleeps naked. Dosan. Taste. I know it could look the same, but as long as it tastes right. Ooh, underdone. Ugh. You're not firing me. And of course, if it's a movie shoot, actress, who's it got to be? <laughs> Spoken like a true businessman. Ooh. It's so weird. Uh, that hairstyle, though. <laughs> Boobs. Boobs. I know that's gonna be the first time he's ever seen a. He's seen her actually act. Capitan! <laughs> oh my god, that, that, that fucking. That flustered face. I All the Ichika fans, and there are plenty out there, um, totally gonna be happy this episode. Sorry, brothers, uh, opening the garage. I will always, g if you're landing an acting role, I don't blame anyone from picking that over school. <laughs> What if it was Futara's one night? That's the wrong pie! She's an actress.
Damn, that was a fast slip on. <laughs> different, different skill, completely different skill. Damn, Futaro. That was... Mm -mm. Exactly, it's that line. <laughs> no, she's not. That hover hand, though. Ah, yep. Yep. I remember that panel. And. Oh, no, no. We still got a couple minutes, right? Oh, come on. That's only 25 pounds. I also got to remember I do kind of. I do lifting every day at work, so. <laughs> Back handlers. I would be Nino's bag handler any day. Some people might call me a simp. Y'all just jealous. I've had Meiji chocolate. It's actually really good. Very surprisingly. Meiji, or I think it was Meiji, but Meiji chocolate, pretty damn good. Boob. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh, you thunder, eh, you? Ah, oh, that's right. Every kind? Oh, it's for he eats <laughs> key. <laughs> Which makes sense. Yeah, Itsuki is an interesting character. That's your dad? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Already ate them all. He's just drinking an espresso. <laughs> no, you know. It's weird how much they change their perspective on them.
And how does he not notice? Guild spell left. I like Yotsuba. Yotsuba has, has great heart. I mean, in all honesty, though, like this is a form of tough love, and I'm, well, I might not agree with it. I think that it's a good way to drive a goal. Again, it might be a little bit too harsh, but who knows. Okay. I just want to make sure. Okay, we don't have an ending. We do not have an ending. All right. Again, this one definitely was a setup episode. You see, you saw some really good moments with Ichika, and I know a lot of the Ichika fans are going to be head over heels over this episode. Um, you know, had more of the heartthrobs, which continues to an eventual really good situation that happens later on down the line. Um, but I actually am curious for the anime only people who, what you think is going to happen. Um, I'm remembering bits and pieces again. I've only reread, I've only read the series once and never reread it. Uh, certain scenes I've reread because of reasons, but yeah, but I'm curious as to what you guys would actually say. Um, with that whole, with everything that's going on with this. Uh, but let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode reaction. And as always, Nino is best girl. I'll see you guys next time. See ya.